Hello world, here is Bitty, your Bitcoin trading infoman. Here is your ADA, your Cardano trading infoman. And we will check together now what's going on here with ADA, with Cardano. And we will check this now. This is the one hour chart and you can see every candle is here one hour. And the biggest thing I would like to show you guys is this one. We had here the highest point, $2.47. And we have here this down going line here. This was our resistance line. And you can see it. We broke this line here on this point. We retested it here. And now it's really possible to see a nice pump to the upside. Some things we have to watch now. And this is the thing I would like to show you. This is the thing about Ada Cardano. From the downside is coming here a really nice support line. And this was our triangle. This was our triangle, our sideways going tri triangle. And we saw a breakout of this triangle a retest and now this price region here. So, okay, guys, the next thing is we need to watch the Fibonacci retracement from the highest point to the lowest point. This was uh, this point here. And now you can see we are acting between two Fibonacci lines. We are acting between the 0 0.382 Fibonacci line and the 0 0.5 Fibonacci line. These two Fibonacci's are now very important. We need, very important, we need to fight over this. We need um, a fight against $1.74. This is, in my opinion, one of the biggest things now we have to watch. From the downside on the one hour chart is also coming a nice line. This line, this is also a nice support line. Hey guys, it's also possible to uh, retest this support line. So it's also possible not to go higher from here to retest this support line momently on $1.45 and then an upgoing price. This is the things we have to watch now on this one hour chart picture here. The main thing, in my opinion, guys, is this one. This was the last high. In my opinion, we need now a higher high. $1.70 was the last high. Now we need a higher high. This is very important. On the downside, we can see the RSI and the RSI is also very interesting because we are here on the price region. We are here on the points about 65 points. We are not overbought for the moment. Overbought is everything over 70, but we are nearly overbought here on um, 60, 65, 66. So this is the thing we also need to watch here on the downside. Uh, the next thing we have to watch is the MACD. What is telling us this indicator? Very important. The MACD on the downside is telling us, okay, we are for the moment bullish because we saw here a nice, a nice cross the blue line over the brown line and we are buying now more and more green candles. This is interesting. MACD is bullish. What is telling us our EMA ribbon band if we are zooming in? And this is also very nice. We had here this, um, this crossing here. We had here uh, a red ribbon band. And now we have a green one with a nice long position since this point here. And this ribbon band is a really nice support now. Also a really nice support is this yellow line. This is the EMA 200. Also a really nice support. So maybe we are retesting now EMA 200 or the ribbon band. Or we are retesting 0 0.382 or $1.56. This would be, in my opinion, a really nice next long position to the upside. Guys, very important. I'm not a financial advisor. This is not a financial advice. Um, let's check the next stuff. Let's check the 4-hour time frame. And that MACD on the downside is also bullish on the 4-hour time frame. Blue line over the brown line. We are buying more and more green candles. Very, very nice. The ribbon band is here red. We saw a short position on the four hour time frame on this point. We are going sideways now a little bit and we are for the moment over this red ribbon band. Important stuff. We need a green ribbon band. We need to hold over this ribbon band. This would be amazing. And here you can see also this yellow line on the four hour time frame. This is the EMA 200 also. So maybe also here on the four hour time frame, retest $1.59, $1.60 or our Fibonacci line and then an upgoing price. This is also very possible here in my opinion. So we can make another stuff, guys. We can make a really nice um, parallel channel to the upside uh, from this point over this point to this point. This is the first thing. This is the long time frame parallel channel. And you can see we are over the middle line. Middle line is also acting as a support. And we can make another thing on the short time frame, on the one hour time frame. We can also make a parallel channel to the upside this one and now you can see we are fighting between these 
blue lines here, this middle line and this middle line. So these lines are also our next things we have to watch. And you can see it, guys. This middle line is measuring now with our Fibonacci 0 0.5. So $1.74, big, big resistance in my opinion here, Fibonacci and middle line. But first, I told you guys we need to make a higher high. For the moment, we're going down a little bit. You can see we are having problems here with higher highs. We're going down a little bit and that's the next thing we have to watch. Um, guys, that's the fast update here for 8 or for the next hours. I wish you the best of luck. It doesn't matter if you go long or if you go short, guys. I wish you you make millions out there. Guys, thank you very much for watching this two update by BT or Bitcoin Trading Information. Guys, I have a live stream. I have an ADA live stream. Please watch it. I'm streaming on Twitch and on YouTube. The name is ADA Trading Information. And I hope we see us there. Guys, thank you very much and bye bye.